I bought the Skims Swarovski collection. When I think of Swarovski, I think of like their cute little crystal figurines or their like very extra crystal jewelry. So this collaboration with Skims is not one that I had on my bingo card for 2023, but I'm excited. Also, you know that I love anything but jewels. So far, we've just got the regular Skims packaging. So this collaboration collection is actually divided into like three mini collections. We have the cotton collection, which is the most affordable. It's like Wear. The Jelly Sheer collection that comes in these kind of like skin toned colors. And of course the star collection, the stretch net. And we got a little bit of all of them. You might be thinking Hope, another Kardashian clothing review. Listen, I just get tagged in it a lot, <laughs> but you can totally give me any recommendations for any brand or product you want to see reviewed. We need to talk about the packaging though, because I'm a tiny bit disappointed. I don't know if you remember, but a couple years ago, Skims and Fenty did a collaboration and the packaging for that collaboration was out of this world. So good, so cute. Granted, that collection was a tiny bit more expensive than this one, but like still, I don't know. But, so there I was like shopping this collection. I was honestly just throwing things in my cart as fast as I could because I forgot about it. I used to be like on the ball with launches when that's all I would do is review activewear launches. Lately, not so much. <laughs> so I remembered about this collection like a couple hours after it launched. So I got as much as I could. And then right before I checked out, I was like, oh, I should just throw a little necklace in for fun. So I did, and then I went to my cart, and then I realized that little necklace was $3,300. <laughs> so I took that out. As beautiful as that is, that's a lot of money. They actually did have a $125 necklace that's just this little cute simple one with like the one crystal, but that one sold out like instantly, so. Oh, okay, wait, we got some cute somethings. A couple regulars. But look, where's the dress? Well, I was gonna say, I'm saving the most expensive item for last, but now I'm definitely saving it for last because it's not here. Why would they not send me that? Ugh. Trying what I have and then we'll try on the dress later, I guess. Um. Hi, it's Future Hope Scope here. As you can see, I am not in my cute cotton Swarovski crystal gray set. More on why later. But for now, we are skipping to the Jelly Sheer collection. Okay, the Jelly Sheer collection. Like I said, a lot of stuff was sold out. So I got the cocoa cacao color which I'm actually kind of glad about. I wanted that one or the black one because the like birthday suit look that perfectly matches your skin tone isn't really for me. So I think the brown will be cute. Okay, so I got the leggings, but unfortunately the matching top was completely sold out. But I did see that Skims has a fits everybody turtleneck top also in the cacao color. So I figured the colors will match perfectly, but it just doesn't have any sparkles on it. But the leggings will, we'll see. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're pretty. Fabric's interesting. It just has like an elastic waistband. <gasps> but it's so pretty. Okay, I can't tell if the crystals are brown or if they're a clear crystal. Either way, very, very beautiful. I'm so interested to see how this feels when they're on because I do have the Skims Outdoor Crystal Collection that they came out with a few months ago. And honestly, I wear that crystal bodysuit like everywhere. I travel in it, road trips, airplanes. I wear it everywhere. Since they're a flat back crystal, you don't feel them at all when you sit. So hopefully this is the same way. Okay, okay, be right back. Okay, these are fun. Okay. I can confirm that this fits everybody cacao does match the Swarovski pretty well, actually. I really like this look together because like the leggings are kind of a lot with the sparkle and then I feel like having a plain top kind of breaks it up. That's so fun. They're actually so comfy too. I think I'm a fan of these. Is it comfy to sit in though? Yeah, you can't really feel the crystals at all, surprisingly. That's nice. I also appreciate that they weren't like frugal with the the crystals. They go all the way around because it's one of my biggest pet peeves when you get something with like crystals or a design and it's like only on the front panel and not the back, but <laughs> they put an even amount of crystals all the way around and it's just great. Okay, I really like this little outfit. It's a cute little fall outfit. All right, I got one more jelly sheer thing. This is the cat suit. This was $200. $148, so kind of a lot of money, but it's Swarovski crystal. Oh, <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so cool. And I love how they placed the crystals, how they're kind of more concentrated along the top. Oh, this is gonna be so fun. Okay, here's the black bodysuit. This is so cool. Makes me wanna like dance or something. <laughs> That's literally what it feels like. It's like a, a dance 
tights material. Also, I know it's called Jelly Sheer, and it is like really, really thin material, but I'm actually surprised at how not sheer it is. Like, I mean, I'd still wear something under it, but it's not that sheer, which I'm so glad. I was afraid it was gonna be like literally body tights, but oh, this is so beautiful. I was saying earlier that I like how they do the crystals all around, but I feel like they were also smart with the placement. Like you can see it's all around on the outside of the arm, but they did less on the inside. And I think that's good so that it doesn't like snag, you know? They kind of did that on the insides of the legs too. Otherwise I feel like the crystals would just pop off, but this is so pretty. Okay, these are definitely black crystals. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. Gotta figure out how to style this though. <laughs> like where am I wearing this? It's so comfy, especially cause most cat suits that are long sleeve, full leg can get very, very hot. So this is very breathable. <gasps> Wait, I know what I need to wear with these. I'll be right back. Crystal boots. <laughs> these are Stuart Wiseman. I can't remember if these are Swarovski or not. I wouldn't be surprised if they were. These boots are also like a full leg situation. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Oh yeah. <laughs> It just makes sense. Okay, and then one more thing. Have to accessorize with some more sparkles. Oh, this is an outfit. This is a like go to Vegas or something in this outfit. Okay, this bodysuit is actually so cool. Maybe the boots are a little overkill, but I thought it would be fun to try. <laughs> one of my thoughts and probably one of your thoughts was how on earth do you wash this stuff? <laughs> Honestly, most of my clothes, I'm just kind of lazy and I like wash them like normal. I probably shouldn't do that, but I saw in Swarovski's comment section, they told somebody to hand wash only in cold water with the piece of clothing turned inside out in a soft laundry bag <laughs> and then air dry. That's a lot. They didn't like send extra crystals or something. So if you lose a bunch of them, they're gone forever. Okay, our stretch net dress, which isn't here yet, but future hope is gonna pop in and it will be here. Okay, so a lot of people on social media were commenting on the post about this dress, like, where is anybody gonna wear this? I would agree with how they're wearing it. <laughs> like, just the net dress itself with a teeny tiny, like, thong bodysuit underneath. I also don't see myself wearing that anywhere, but imagine, like, a pink shiny dress under the pink shiny bubblegum dress. And I have just the one. This little guy. <laughs> so this is from Halara. You you might recognize it from my haul that I just did on this channel. Listen, I know I said I was only keeping three dresses from that video, but I saw this one and immediately I was like, this is gonna be perfect under my Skims dress. So I'm sorry I lied to you, but I had to keep it. So this is the part of the video where I'm supposed to try on my super cute bubblegum pink Swarovski crystal net dress. But not only did it not show up, it's never gonna show up, unfortunately. So after I filmed the part of the video that you just saw, I emailed Skims and I was like, hey, I got charged. The email says that all of this stuff was delivered, but I'm missing a couple very important pieces. And I was kind of thinking maybe they're just shipping separately, although I knew that probably wasn't the case because I had had this Skims package at my house for like a week before I filmed this video. They emailed me back and they basically said, we don't have those items. Uh... So that's a little bit weird to me that like I had to be the one to reach out. <laughs> like what was their plan? Were they just gonna keep my money and never send me those items? I am very confused. And I just have to vent a little bit because this is the second time this has happened. The first time was with a totally different brand, but I don't get it. Why didn't they tell me that right after I placed the order when they shipped the stuff that they did have? I don't know. I almost didn't post this video because that stuff didn't show up, but I feel like it's important, especially on this channel. As I'm reviewing things, I wanna show you like my good experiences with brands and my not so good experiences with brands. And Skims did in that email, immediately refund me for the items that they didn't have, offered me 30% off my next purchase, but like what would have happened if I never reached out? That's the part that's strange to me. I don't know, maybe it's just hard to find good customer service help in 2023, I don't know. And the other brand that I ordered from, they were like trying not to refund me at all. They were like, oh, we don't do refunds. And I was like, you literally didn't send me my products. What do you mean you don't do refunds? <laughs> By the way, if you're not subscribed to this channel, make sure that you are. This is the Hang with Hope Scope channel, which is my super secret second channel. This is where we do reviews. We just hang out. It's a little more chill. Um, thanks so much for watching. You should check out my Kai by Kylie Jenner or Good American by Khloe Kardashian reviews if you haven't binge watched those yet. And we'll see you in the next video. Say bye, YouTube.